Really? Let Paimon try! Congratulations, guide from the future. You have completed a challenge that even I found ambitious. And now, I finally have the chance to tell you my story. You may have heard legends describing me as the best guide in all of Natlin. But in the beginning, I was more like a treasure hunter. I chased results, facing countless dangers to prove myself. Time after time, I ventured where others didn't dare, never failing to bring back rare treasures. My fame was second to none. And yet, I never felt satisfied. So I found a new goal, a challenge that no one had ever achieved before. The legendary Mysterious Island. Another chance to prove myself. Unfortunately, my friends who had traveled with me all this time had grown tired of my nonsense. Instead of praise, they now showered me with words of caution. Perhaps this journey was one that I had to complete alone. But luckily, they decided to once again put up with my antics. Just as before, they came up with ingenious ways to help me move forward. They never let me down, even when I had to place my life in their hands. And they always trusted my judgment, even when it took a lot of courage. In the end, just as ever, we found the result we came for. But... That golden glow was baiting me towards death. It was the glow of a rare ore, but it was also the warning sign of an impending eruption. Maybe if I pressed on and put my life on the line, I could get the result I wanted. And yet, there was a chance I'd lose something even more precious. But don't worry. In the end, I made the same choice as you. Everyone was disappointed that their illustrious guide had, for once, returned empty-handed. But seeing everyone survive, I felt satisfied for the first time in my life. Perhaps the treasure I had really been searching for had been right here with me all along. So, I decided to end my long journey and find a safe place for my hard-earned treasure. To me, this is the real mysterious island. The hidden inscriptions disappeared! These must have been the words the first chief left for those that would come after him. In that case, the mysterious island from the legend is actually where the people of the springs are living now! I remember now that the elders once told me our tribe was originally founded on a small island. Later, the coastlines changed, allowing the island to become what it is today. The journey to the mysterious island starts exactly where it ends. Yeah, I think I understand the choice he made now. The golden glow is an indicator of when the lava will periodically erupt. Hmm. If that's the case, the principle of vulcanite formation implies that it will only appear at the start of fierce lava activity, and the flowing lava will quickly swallow it and make it all disappear without a trace. This means that there's zero possibility of ever bringing the ore back. Are the results I've been chasing all this time only an illusion that can be seen from far away? Harondra... Our journey is not yet over. As we agreed, please come back to the people of the springs with me. Then we'll officially complete this journey. Fine. I suppose that would also count as some kind of result. Don't be so down. I have a feeling that the next answer I'm looking for will also be useful to you. Paimon remembers now. There's still 